goodness, that is the cutest thing I ever did see. I want you guys to take that some perspective. That is a MacBook charger. Those are relatively small. And he just fits. Precious babies! The sun is probably the closest thing we'll ever have to a true Eldritch abomination. All right, hear me out here. Older than recorded history, was here longer than any of us, and will be here long after we leave. Has a finite beginning and end, but is still incomprehensibly agent. Burns itself into your vision instantly and can blind you if you look for too long. Further prolonged exposure can cause cancerous growth. Non-humanoid shape floating through space. Colossal flaming tentacles angrily lashing out on occasion. Sort of just appeared one day and is now surrounded by the corpses of its stillborn children. People used to sacrifice other people to appease it. Pretty sure it screams at us sometimes. No, 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 man. The moon is where it's at. Source of countless religions and traditions. Where we get the idea that three is a magic number from waxing, full, and waning. Follows you in cars, humans design calendars around it, pockmarked witchy face, gunpowder smell, produces none of its own light, one side kept in perpetual darkness, mapped in Latin the language of witches, and moves the ocean where mostly witchy creatures live. Okay, guys, you're both right. Country rats wearing hats while I go give them pats, West Virginia. I love drinking Gatorade in a jar. What? Why? It restores half my HP. My three-year-old said our cat needed some rocks. Eh, <sighs> cat seems to agree. Look, the only live-action Disney remake I want is The Emperor's New Groove, and I want there to be no CGI. I want Cusco to be played by two actors in a cheap llama costume. My god, I'd throw money at that movie. There are snakes in my boots. <laughs> love conventions. Imagine roughly a million people realizing, yeah, we could storm a government facility and they literally would not be able to stop us all. And not using that knowledge to overthrow the government. <clears throat> Post that put me on a list. Where do TV shows get this idea that high school is constant drama? Nothing even freaking happened to me in high school. Okay, now I'm remembering that my school got a slurping machine and then had to get rid of it two weeks later after someone poured toxic chemicals into it that they stole from the science lab and attempt to poison the entire cheerleading squad. So like, maybe I was just boring. Where do TV shows get this idea that high school is emotional drama? It's all chemical warfare and espionage. Ah, uh, yeah. Now this is what I'm talking about. Oh. My. GOD I HATE THIS SITE! I DON'T NEED A TUTORIAL TO WRITE A TEXT POST! It's like a wise man once said, Tumblr may teach you to post, but they cannot teach you to post. That wise man? Well, let's say he's off somewhere, sleeping while his sticks are burning. RANDY! YOUR STICKS! BUZZFEED! 25 things you didn't know about Harry Potter. <laughs> Try me, bitch. You are angry about something. Clam down, I text you. You assume I made a typo, but in fact I am holding a small soldier clam in my hands. <laughs> he died so young. War as hell. Today I learned the first website on the internet was a page explaining what the internet is and how to make web pages. It was like the tutorial for the internet we all skipped. Psh, I don't need no tutorial on how to use internet. Life advice number one. If you experience a breakup, Wrap yourself up in blankets, eat chocolate ice cream, and watch horror movies. Works every time. I, I'm a solid testimonial to that statement. Does work. Asexuals are confused, bisexuals are confused, pansexuals are confused, homosexuals are confused, heterosexuals are confused. Everyone is confused as to why you think you should have a say about a relationship that doesn't involve you. This, this ended so nicely. And also how to do taxes. We're, we're confused about how to do taxes too. Writing style. Author from the 1800s with a severe love of commas whose sentences last half a page. I came out here, to this point, to this place, hoping against all hope and despite signs and portents suggesting otherwise that I might, somehow, find myself having a pleasant experience. And yet here I stand, alone against the world, feeling assaulted, attacked on all fronts, Knowing not my enemy's name, nor his face, nor whether our battle is done. I, is that a, I came here to have a good time and I honestly feel so attacked right now, but by Oscar Wilde? Yes, it was. Exactly that. Behold, a goth. Out of every pun and play on words I've seen on this site, this is the one that makes me so unreasonably angry! Ah!